Hello everybody, welcome to another M13 draft. And I'm pretty sure the pick here is Sublime Archangel. Pretty bomb malicious. Uh cards to note for tabling purposes. The switcheroo, the pack leader, blood hunter bat, I'll probably go on. And this pack's pretty weak outside the rare, so we'll just write it off. But this is awesome. So, we saw three black-white exalted decks last draft. So I'd rather not go black-white exalted, but with Archangel makes a strong case to do it. Or we could go a bit controlly with Touch of the Eternal. But I'd rather not do that. I think I'll just take Divine Verdict. It's removal color. Removal spell on color. Not much else in the pack. Maybe the Mark. Primal Clay. Battleflight Eagle. Fairy Invaders. Some decent red low drop. Boar's alright. But Van Verdict's fine. White something. Not sure of the other direction we want to go. Maybe we'll get past a murder. Although I doubt it. Hmm. I think we take Squire here. It's another exalted creature. It's white. I mean, Crusader's pretty good. And it's nice to see Servant, but we'll just keep with the whiteness. And what do we get? We get a Divination, which I like. An Arbor Elf. Captain's Call, War Priest of Thune. Hmm, I think Captain's Call is probably a better card than War Priest. I'm not sure where I want to go here. I wouldn't mind jumping on Divination. It's not the strongest card to make me go blue. Maybe I just want the bear. Nice out to enchantments. Captain's Call is better, in my opinion. Yeah, maybe we get some Griffin Protectors later. we probably get some more two drops. So, White's been cut, but there's Duty Bound Dead. Which I think I'm going to pick. Just nudge myself into Black White. I mean, the blue's decent, but it's not really what I'm looking to do, so we'll just take the exalted creature. And of course, we get past an Arctic Avon late. And also a servant. So we could give up on the exalted, but I think that's wrong. Let's just nudge ourselves in a black white exalted and pass the clearly superior card, which we could jump into fairly easily. Hmm. No, I think I'm just going to go black-white. Uh, bit of a bummer, though. This card's so good, it could splash it. But, no. Let's give it to black-white exalted. Just do it. Here, we'll take a war priest. Yeah, I guess we'll take an evolving wilds. Which would have made that Avon a much easier splash. Or we could hate Chandra's Fury, which does whoop up on the Exalted deck. But we're going to go Fixing instead. Pretty decent start. We would like to get some Murders and some Pacifisms. That's at the top of the list. Am I going to play this Ox? No, I think I'm going to take a Distant Tomb. It's a rather decent card. Wow. Uh, can't say no to another Duty Abound Dead. The Eagle would have been great too, but... Uh, I don't think this card should go that late. There wasn't a lot of black in that pack, if I remember correctly. Maybe they just don't know.
And I think I want the trick here over the Vile Rebirth. This card has never been really impactful on the board, I feel. And we're a little short on tricks. Ooh, that's nice. That goes good with our Captain's Call. Angels of Mercy's Fane. Pretty good pack one, I'd say. Got some utility. Got some decent removal. Got a whole bunch of exalted creatures. Yeah, I can be happy with this. Ooh, I don't think I've seen that art before. Or at least never noticed it. That's pretty. So, a balmy blue card. Both are sweet removal spells, although I'm taking murder. This pack's pretty loaded. Murder, Prey Upon, Pacifism, Encrust, Talrans. So, removal in every color but red. One of the best blue cards in the format. Probably get rats back. But this pack is crazy. Another A Arctic Aven, but uh, Vampire Nighthawk is no slouch. So, bam. Makes me feel not as bad about passing that first Arctic, Arctic Aven. Now that they have Murder and Nighthawk. And what do we want? Hmm. I do like the recursion on Videlkin, or Valborn Ghoul. But I think I want a mark. I'll probably pick up marks pretty late, though. As crazy as it sounds, I've seen this guy table pretty frequently. And it would be nice just to keep our curve four and less. Yeah, I'm leaning towards Mark. This card has gotten to be like a topic of overvaluing it. Hellborn Ghoul is fine. Pretty good and exalted. Uh, yeah, I'm going to take the Veilborn Ghoul. Probably get another mark. Uh, Sarah Angel's fine. That's pretty sweet. The Harbor Bandit, that's that's pretty good as well. But can't pass a Sarah. So we can take a Giant Scorpion or a Sunstriker. Do we need the defense? Do we need that Death Touch? Or do we want just life gain race? I think I'm more happy with a two drop life linker. With all our exalted. I think we're going to need the giant scorpion. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, tormented soul? Sign and Blood, Divine Verdict, all very good. But I think we just want to get aggressive. And we're getting a little cut on Exalted, but I think we just want the Tormented Soul here. As typical Magic Drafting, all the cards you want are always in one pack. If I added that Mark, I'd definitely want the Soul. Which I'm going to take anyway. Probably get another mark at some point. Mm, here, I think I want Crusader. Over the other Vampire or Mastiff. Yep. Crippling Blight. Yes, I do. I like Crippling Blight quite a bit in Exalted decks. Especially when, you're, when you run across a Fog Bank. It's one way to deal with that nonsense. And here's our first pack. I'm not too excited about a divine favor. I'm just gonna hate out and encrust, I suppose. Yeah, let's do that. Or get a rare draft, I suppose. 
Alrighty. Tricks of the trade and unsummon would have been sweet, but I guess we'll take duress for the board. Ugh, having a bit of a sneezing fit. I don't think I'll need any of these artifacts, so let's just take a divine favor. Ugh. Uh, here I'm going to take safe passage over to rest. Don't know if I'll play it main deck. Most likely not. Not too worried about Minotaur. I don't want to get blasted out. Got a decent creature count going into pack 3. Not nearly as much exalted as I was hoping for. We just have the 1, 2, 3... Four, five sources. I'm not sure about the ghoul pick. Maybe I did want that mark. Uh, some red bombs. I'm just gonna take the bat. Probably get the eagle or the guardians to the table. But I'm passing some bomby goblin cards. It's pretty gross. Uh, Prowler it is. A third Arctic Haven, which is nuts. And a Magma Quake. Someone is getting a sweet red deck, but we gotta take Murder. Third pick Murder. I can be happy with that. That pack must have been crazy, because those are all awesome cards. Unless people are just friendly drafters and don't hate. What do we get? Passing a switcheroo for a crippling blight. I don't think the falcon is doable. One soldier. Yeah, we'll just take the crippling blight. And here... We take a Ring of Thune, although it seems black is our main color. Could just take a vanilla two drop. Hmm. Oh, uh, even Vigilance on a Nighthawk isn't bad. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Probably not eight. Could just hate a removal spell. I have quite a few two drops. I guess I'll take the ring. Not too excited about it. Uh, here we're gonna take Sign Blood. Pretty happy about that. I think we want another Exalted body rather than the draw effect. Our Exalted is currently one, two, uh, three, four. Yeah, not as high as I want, so let's take that. Uh, another Sun Striker is pretty good. Wow, hmm. I think we'll take another Divine Verdict. I do like myself a Battleflight Eagle, but we still might get another one back, or we could get an Exalted. Nah, this will make a pretty good removal suit. Two Blights, two Murders, two Verdicts. Yeah, I like that. I'm not going to play the Falcon. I'll just take this Divination. Take a Lion. Take away the F Kindle Fury. Hopefully, I think we may have another chance at a Battleflight Eagle. I'm not going to play the Mastiff. I'm not going to play the Ring. Captain's Call, we're not getting too much mileage out of. Only with the Blood Throne Vampire. Distant Tomb, probably not gonna need that. No Show Valor. Might just cut the Vampire. 
cut in the captain's call. It makes a strong case to cut that as well. Oh, the line's definitely cut. So here's a good 23, I feel. 16 creatures. Good amount of removal. Lots of 1, 2s, and 3s. Nice curve. Pretty concise deck. Looking pretty good. So let's see if we can remember what we just did. No. So let's just see how we're looking. Find favor. How'd that get in there? Heaven Square is what we wanted. Awesome removal package, good draw, some good lifelink. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven sources of exalted. Some nice crippling blights. Yeah, I don't think it can get much better than this. Life don't get much better than this. Could go sixteen lands. But we have a draw spell, so maybe 17 isn't that bad. 8 and 8 with an Evolving Wilds. Yeah, this deck pretty much made itself. So uh, I'll see you for round 1.